beautiful morning. Just a bit of a chill in the air. But I think it's time to pick this last fig. Look at this beauty. I'm going to have this for my breakfast. Not as big as the other one. But look at that. I think I'll have some mint as well. Moroccan mint. in the sunshine. Ooh. Anyway, time for breakfast. My breakfast this morning. Doesn't that look tempting? I've stewed some of the apple that my friend gave me along with some foraged blackberries. So that's just some of that. Toasted some bread. One of the oranges that I got reduced a couple of weeks ago now. I've just got one left. My homegrown fig and this cheese that I got last week, Wensleydale and pineapple, reduced to 25p. Do you know it's absolutely delicious. So that's my breakfast this morning, sitting in the sunshine, nice cup of coffee. And when my washing machine's finished spinning, I shall be hanging that out on the washing line to dry in the sunshine. I'm going to leave this cup of boiling water to cool down, to just being warm because I intend to make a pizza this morning. Having a cup of tea, well I shall make the pizza dough and then about one o'clock, two o'clock I'll make the pizza because Did I move you then? Where is it? Last night I went to Sainsbury's. Um, just got a few things. I got some eggs. They're Stamford Street eggs. 
Still 173, free range. 10. Quite small ones this time. Brown. Just a few things, and there was just a few things on the reduced section, but I did find this ready to eat char grilled chicken breast chunks from 130 down to 10 pence. And I thought I could pop some of that on, on the pizza. I might actually sprinkle this with a little bit of, um, what, what was I thinking? I was either thinking to dip it into my chilli sauce that I made, my homemade chilli sauce, or even sprinkle a little bit of um, Indian spice on it. Anyway, we'll make the pizza dough and um, well, I'll wait for that to cool first. Make the pizza dough and then I'll decide. I've just got 12 ounces of strong white bread flour, half a teaspoon of salt, three quarters of a sachet of yeast and the warm water. I intend to make a few bread cakes as well. Just bringing it all together now. Then I shall knead it and leave it to rise. Time to get my hands dirty, I think. I've just coated that kneaded bread with a little bit of olive oil and now I shall leave it to rise. So I've made my mind up what I'm going to do. I'm going to add some tomato puree to some of the homemade sweet plum chilli sauce and use that as the tomato base for the pizza. Slicing up one of these tomatoes that I got reduced last week from Aldi. I'm going to use some sliced red onion, some simply mozzarella from Lidl, and some of these sliced, well, I'm going to slice some of these chilies that I got reduced from the co-op. Was it last week, the week before? And then I'll put some of the chicken on top. So I've got everything prepared in advance, that's the tomato chilli sauce, slice some tomato, I've just used a third of the mozzarella, got some garlic, some of my dried homegrown oregano, there's only three pieces of the chicken there, some sliced red onion and some sliced chilies, red and green. And I shall go out and pick some of my fresh oregano from the garden as a garnish, I think. I just caught this pizza in time. I'd forgotten about it, to tell you the truth. It looks delicious. I love the smell of garlic on bread. Just brush it with a little bit of olive oil. That's my lunch today. Some of the char grilled chicken that I got reduced to 10p on my homemade pizza. I actually made a loaf of bread rather than bread cakes. And that looks delicious too. Nice rustic bread. 
Take care, people.